So the client wants me to leave this part of the video and just speed it up. Basically do a time lapse. And I found out that this effect makes the time lapse quite better. First, we have to delete the audio, hold option and select it with the mouse and hit delete. Then we'll have to speed the clips. Don't go into the inspector, use these two shortcuts. With a clip selected, you can either press the R key and from here you can change the clip speed, let's say 600 and enter. My preferred way is to hold command R with the clip selected. This way I can slow down or speed up the clip. At a dynamic zoom, I prefer to zoom in. So I'll hit on the swap, turn on the dynamic zoom option so we can select the red square and just readjust the positioning. And to make it a little bit better, effects panel, motion trails. Make the trail length and the drop off all the way up to 10. It's how it looks the best to me. Just to give you an example, if we turn out the drop off, it's kind of like you didn't add any effect at all. The drop off is kind of like adding this ghosting effect. If you zoom out, you will get this black border. So to avoid this, here under border tab, set it to replicate. Since it's so blurry, nobody will notice. How would they know? Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.